I've taken a look at this as we speak. First time that any of us had an opportunity to look at this film. We started at around 10 o'clock last night on the web. Uh, that's where it's available. That's the only phone it's available. And I'm looking at it right now, and I'm having a hard time getting through it. As we debate this, it's a principle of mine that I won't vote on anything that I don't understand or have not read. Uh, I would urge all of us to keep in mind what is called the precautionary principle that in life, and in science, and in medicine, and in politics, if you don't understand, if you don't know, if you've not had the opportunity, then the only thing you can do is vote no. This is, this is an 18,000 word document that we just got a hold of. We cannot possibly understand the ramifications of this bill in the time that we have, and I for one am not willing to trust even my caucus members are on the committee with the substance of this bill. It's too complicated. It's too far-reaching. We have not had the time to understand it and vet it and then act on it in the best interest of the people of the state of Maine. I proudly sit on the Marine Resources Committee under the able House Chairmanship of Representative Wendell Weaver. I can tell you that we have taken more time caring for the clams and the clam flats of the state of Maine that we are taking down, taking care of the people of the state of Maine with this bill. I urge you, do not vote for this bill now because it is being rushed through. It's interpreted and inappropriate. Uh, I'm going to vote no, Mr. Speaker, and I urge you, like the preceding speaker, to try to find a way to take the poison out of this process and give us the time to really look at this bill, there may be pieces of it that I can support. But I, I'm looking for them right now. This is not the time for me to be looking for them. It's not the time for any of you to be looking for them. I urge a no vote, and I ask that we find a way to bring this to a more temperate resolution, because I'm afraid that if this is pushed through the way it is now, it's going to poison the rest of our sessions. Thank you for this opportunity to speak.